What's up everybody, Pumpkin here. So today I just finished like a nine hour stream or something and we tried a bunch of different decks. And one of the more interesting decks that I played today was a bandit deck, but it wasn't just a few bandit decks. It was a lot of bandits. Uh, actually the majority of this deck is bandits. And then we have a little bit of a package with Draco uh, Turtle towards the end. Um, but yeah, bandits are actually pretty cool. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised. I was planning on just running a few bandits and hoping to get value, but why run a few bandits when you can just play lots of bandits? Um, so basically, uh, every playable bandit is in the deck, uh, with the exception of Carlo. I've been switching back and forth between, uh, One-Eyed Betsy and Carlo. They do different things. Um, in shorter rounds, Betsy is going to be better, uh, but you can obviously change it if you don't like it. The reason Immortal doesn't really make the list is because... Other than Priest, it doesn't really have any synergy, and it doesn't work very well with uh, Free Company, because Free Company boosts all bandits, and, well, this can't get boosted. Angolami is a meme. Uh, it's a fun meme, but kind of a meme. These two cards suck. Uh, this card's not very good anymore. These two cards are not good, uh, and this is quite bad outside of Enhanced Necker. So, yeah, I'm, I'm even running this one, because it's just decent enough. It's a 5 for 4. Uh, and then on top of that, you can utilize the armor with priests, and it's worth one extra. And six for four is good enough. Plus, it's potentially even seven for four uh, if you're playing free company that round. So, uh, basic combo, uh, I should say. The leader's kind of weird. I'm playing Arnoff because, well, there's nothing better to play. Uh, there really aren't any better leaders to be playing in a deck like this that is basically just neutral cards. Um, so, this is like decent value it's okay i run this plus uh Sfrenridge. i run the two cards together and that's basically it that's the only synergy so if you don't like this leader you switch it for something else that's completely fine uh i would love to run something like maybe dagger herald or something uh the problem with that is armor kind of mitigates uh two points on each ping of armor so that's not very good but you probably could get away with the armor just because or get around the armor because you are running two sappers but anyways i'm gonna go through the deck um yeah, so Draco Turtle, this card is really, really cool. Um, basically, you want to give this a ton of armor, and then you take all the armor off with Shade, and it gets a ton of value. Uh, all armor on this card is worth 2x multiple. Um, so if you give it 3 armor, you're going to get 3 extra value on Draco Turtle and 3 extra value on Shade, which is why Wagon in this deck is technically worth 10 value, which is really good. Uh, Royal Decrees for consistency. You have three really important cards that you want to be finding. You have Iris Shade and Draco Turtle for the combo. Uh, and obviously, Sfran Ridge is good for your leader because it is an 11. Iris Shade is for Draco Turtle. Gascon. Uh, this is pretty decent in the deck just because it plays two bandits, and that's pretty good. And every now and then, you get lucky and you get the bandit that you need, and you win the game. Yeah. So there are, I believe, seven bandits. So you have almost a 50% chance to hit the one you want. Yep. Uh, One-Eyed Betsy's removal. Covenant of Steel is probably one of the better defenders in the game. Works well with Priest. Uh, with Priest, it basically means Priest gets a free target every single turn. Um, yeah, and it protects your other engines. Uh, Wily goes through armor, which is kind of neat. And it's a bandit, so it's in the deck. Uh, Nickers, or Snickers, as I call it on stream, so that chat doesn't turn into 12-year-olds. Um, yeah, it's just a good card. We don't know how it's coded yet, and that might be a while before we do know how it's coded. But it's a bandit. And it thins, and it's better than Roach, so we play it. Uh, Sranridge, talked about a little earlier, works with uh, Arnoff. If you don't like this card, or you don't like Arnoff, feel free to swap them. Free Company. Uh, this card is pretty cool. Basically, the more bandits you play, the more value this card gets. Uh, and that's pretty good. So, yeah. Good card. Um... Vladimir. So this card's kind of weird. I was really hoping this card would work well with Draco Turtle and it would flip flop and like it would e get extra value. Uh, from my experiences, it doesn't really do that or it's like it does it by one value or something. It, it's it, yeah, it doesn't really work. Um, usually I just use this offensively uh, against enhanced Neckers. They get pretty tall and then you can flip flop their health and their two armor, which is pretty good. Um, yeah, sometimes this card's pretty bad. Every now and then it's really, really good. Um, against Ergen, if they play it later into the round and you don't have a sapper, it's pretty good. Um, it's just good enough, and it's a bandit, and it's better than the other bandits. You can drop the card if you want, but more often than not, I find this card getting more than seven value, and that's just good enough for the deck. Wolfden is tall-ish removal. Um, it's a flex card. I didn't really see any better seven to play, so I play Wolfden. Sapper, 
Uh, you can kind of blow out people. Monsters is going to see a lot of play, and Ergen is very, very good in Monsters. Uh, and this card obviously is very powerful against Ergen. Uh, Boat Builders, you could drop this card. I play it because, well, it's essentially a wagon, but you pay one extra and you get one extra. I mean, wagon is better, but eh, it's not terrible. There really aren't better cards, but if you don't like the card, feel free to drop it. Priest Surge is good. Iron Falcon Infantry. This card's actually pretty good. Uh, you're running multiple ways of giving armor, so you can pretty consistently get this off, and that's kind of cool. Um, a lot of the times I'll play this card, I'll give it two armor, and then I'll save it for the next round, and it's basically an engine that's semi-protected, and it boosts itself every turn. That's pretty cool. Uh, that's why this card is in the deck, but on top of that, whoops, the armor, okay, that card is... Okay, never mind. Uh, the armor is obviously nice for this engine, but on top of that, you can put it on Draco Turtle. Um, putting on Draco Turtle is typically better just because, well, all armor you put on it is worth two more, like two X multiple more. So the two armor is worth four value. This is essentially like an eight point play or a four that gives four carryover if you put it on Turtle. Wagon, as I mentioned before, is like a 10. And Knife Juggler, it makes a cut because it's a bandit. And yep, that's about it. Uh, basic game plan of the deck is win round one-ish. You know, actually, if I lose coin flip, I typically actually don't go for round one. Um, yeah, basically, just play lots of cards, save free company towards the end of a round, play that card. Round two, if you're getting bled, try not to lose card advantage. Feel free to use your leader um, with Fenridge. I mean, ideally, you want to save it for round three, but, like, if your opponent blows their leader, then you don't really mind. Basically, you're you're more than willing to play every single card in the deck with the exception of Iris and Draco Turtle. You always want to save this card for round three because that's where your points are in round three. Um, I will say I always mulligan wagon in round one because this card shines in round three. So I love top decking this card in round three, but in round one, not really a big fan. The exception would be if you have like two of these in your hand or something and you need and you have no other way of giving armor, then you can keep a wagon. But otherwise, uh, I, I'd rather mulligan wagon. Um, if you're playing against a deck that doesn't have any armor, drop sappers. Yeah, it's just a really fun deck. It, it's a very different way to play SK. Uh, it's very, very neutral heavy. Um, but it's a lot of fun. So I highly suggest you give it a try. I have some gameplay for you. Uh, I think... In the gameplay, Betsy might be a Carlos instead. Honestly, it's not a big deal. They both do similar things. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. And I'll see you guys on the next one. A4 tackies. Uh, no other... How does Doggo work? Nobody knows other than the devs. And the devs aren't telling us. Oh. You have a good Squirtle deck? Yeah, dwarfs are really good. Just play Francesca with dwarfs. Very strong. No priest. <laughs> Do you truly believe that will stop me? I can't kill that. <laughs> it's so bad. He's playing debt laugh slug. Slug laugh. Well Alright, I don't mind you emoting, but let's not emote every single turn. Alright. Debt laugh with fruit? Yeah, he's hungry. Seems we've hauled a good catch today. We're just gonna pass here. I was gonna play this, but if I can top deck a priest, we can just set up that combo. Just better. That laugh is a vegan. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I should run Sappers. If people are actually going to start playing this, then I should definitely be playing Sappers. 
I mean, they are bandits. They fit with the deck. The problem is I don't really have 5P slots from. All right, we're looking for a priest. Nice. I don't want that. Uh, that's good. Cleaver's good. We drew this, which means if he goes hard, we have a, a counter. Because we have a few bandits. One, two, three, four. Plus Snickers. Big monsters are actually back. Yeah, I think big monsters are good. I think everything is good, at least in the first couple days. <laughs> so weird looking. <laughs> Mill is good confirmed. No. No. Nine. Oh, yeah? You too? I can do that too. I'm gonna hit this because I can flip flop this with uh, Vladimir if it gets too big. Might as well get free points. Well, he can't pass. <laughs> Snickers to the rescue. Look at that. Gonna lose the round? Easy peasy. I mean, we can flip flop that too. It's a 10 point flip. Seems good. Is it enough though? The 15? And we get plus two? That's enough by one, right? Test Gascon. No, he's just gonna miss again. He's just gonna keep missing, because he's a papaya. This is only bad if he plays BDM, but nobody plays BDM. Kappa. I really wanna play this, but he's playing high tempo every turn. Not the doggo, no! This card is really good. Uh, can you not? That's not very nice. <laughs> bandits OP? I honestly think bandits are good. I don't know. I think... I, I'm not saying they're like OP, but I think they're strong. Alright, we drew everything. We royal turtle, we give it dink dink, and we shade it, and then Gascon is gonna do something. I don't know. Hopefully he'll do something. Alright, so there's the card that kills this, so we roll for that, and hopefully we don't Papiga. Oh, I finally hit a sapper, and then it doesn't hit what we actually need. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. Right, 
Right, one kills both? No, it's bleed. He just plays a card and they get boosted. Because they have Thrive. Why am I playing this leader? He doesn't do anything. Well, I guess we win. <laughs> Alright, 25 point gold. It's pretty good. Alright, this is the last song. We got another like 15 seconds and we're done. I, I keep hearing ass, 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 but I don't think that's what they're saying. Ass, ass, ass. All right, now we I got a special one for you guys. Here we go. <laughs> it's struggling. <laughs> hey, you can follow along with this, even at high speeds. Alright, we're done. No more. Normal music that doesn't give Pumpkin a headache. Kiss from a rose is great at half speed, is it? Kiss from a rose? Half speed? Okay, skip the intro. Oh no. I don't know about that. Wait, which one has armor? Okay, the first one. Oh, okay. Ah, it's terrible. Are you blind? No, it didn't show up the first time. Don't pepega. Okay, chat. You know what? We're not listening to this. No, I'm not blind chat. Ay yo. Yeah, I've played Dwarf. Dwarf is really good. Okay, we keep this, we keep this, and we don't keep that. We need the big lads. That's a big lad. It's pretty big. Ready for 2 0? He can't 2 0 me. I'll smash him. That's too big. Thank you. That was very kind. Give me the milk, father. Thank you for the $4.20, sir. <laughs> okay. <laughs> K 
beautiful. It's so sad, chat. Tee -hee. Uh oh. Plus one. Vladimir works with Turtle. Good. Is Aldane really dead? Yeah, Aldane blows. And not in a good way. Actually leaving the stream because of sound waves. Of all the songs to leave for, is this really the one? There were so many other songs that you could have looked for. <laughs> That's good. You should play Jurgen here, just for funsies. Why would you not hit the card with armor? Hello? Because drain? Yeah, but unless he's passing here, it's better to just play it anyways. Nice music. Yeah, I love it too. It's great. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> You guys want to listen to it again? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Go again! Go again! Mm. I wonder what it's going to auto cue for me. What is this song? Oh. <laughs>
Top Thief Premiums. Uh, we'll gear to Mortal when it comes out, but until then, probably, uh, 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 Svalvola. Yeah, your game is pretty cool too. How much is this worth? This is worth eight. This is worth twelve. It's pretty good. Too big. Too big. Too big. Too big. This is too big. <laughs> it's like, why is that leader on the board? Good question. Here it comes. Can someone link playlist? Quality music. Some All right, if he has a heat wave, we lose. You lied. You can wiggle the boat, hold the scroll down, and move the mouse. Oh, oh, I. I thought you meant wiggle as in like drag and move, not like this. Of course you can move the map. Order Zulal! Please don't have heat wave. I want to see if this works. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can shoot the blister. I know. Come on, lad. Didn't work. <clears throat> ah! You liars. I mean, it's still worth a shit ton. This is a twenty nine. It worked for you. No, it doesn't work. You lied to me, Karma. You lied. Somebody ban Karma, please. Permanently. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Let's go, mate. Come on. You're making this much harder than it needs to be. You don't need to rope every turn. Wow, it was such a difficult play. I am sadness. You have a seven? Eight? Watch him have heat wave all along. Oh my goodness, he's roping his last card. Well, I guess he didn't have an eight.
How is Syndicate Tribute? Uh, Svavola is broken. <laughs> Playing against Nilfgaard? They don't play armor. Two? I don't know, nobody plays muscle anymore, right? Oh, hi, doggo. How are you? Do you think they should rework artifacts? Um... Rework them? Nah. Nothing will stop us. Eh, -heh. you can't metal muzzle. Teehee! The senses can be fooled easily. Never dropped a one, but I've thrown a plenty. The dog is a bandit? Yeah, I know. That's why he fits perfectly in the deck. Have a nice day, handsome. Thank you. <clears throat> Your attention, please. I shall now speak. <laughs> what is this? Why is he humping the star? On, XD. Dude, bandits are so good. I never err in my prediction. Hello? Watch this. Twelve point gold for eight. Are they really okay? I mean, the deck's doing fine. I think it's fine. I don't think it's like OP or anything, but it's not bad. I mean, I should be looking for turtle. Like. Cause it, it's a it's a two card combo and I have neither. Is there anyone here to whom I can entrust my missive? All right, so we're looking for one of these two cards, so we can royal the other. I need to cut both from this deck. Doesn't make any sense. Rub 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 rub. Nice.
Holy shit, how long is this song? Purify removes locks, yes. What about Bolt Builder and Iron Falcon to Mega Boost Turtle, then Sapper for Point Bomb? That's why we have Shade, right? This song is forever, ever, ever. So, basically, you can play a Bandit Package in any deck. There's no planet where he runs Gigney. I want to play around Assassination. <laughs> Why do you play that? Oh, I wanted to try this on this, right? I did say that. <laughs> it's just Kirby songs. Do you guys want to listen to Kirby songs? Holy shit. He's just gonna kill everything. Aye. Is this six? Oh shit, we lose. He just yoinks it. My powers are yours. I don't think that's worth it. XD. <laughs> Nine. Oh, hi, Snickers. I shall do as you mean. Wait, what did he put back? I don't care. I mean, I should care, but yeah, I don't care. He's just gonna Omega yoink it. Discard turtle? No, that doesn't make any sense. I still play it. Shade is 9 armor. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, but I wanna play around Leo. And like, tall removal. So I don't wanna do it first. Thank you. That was very kind. Chapel no! Please don't roll shade! No! 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 <laughs> okay. Give me a heart attack there, buddy.